back-to-back -back champion of the world, Bartosz Marsnik. The Gooter is off gate two in blue, and the Gooter's made a textbook start. Absolute beauty. Now here's the gate four from Smarsnik. That's why he's gone from gate four, because he's got speed. He's long tracking down the back straight, Kelvin Tatum style. The leader is at Artem Laguta. And Bartosz Smarsnik has got speed. Smarsnik's winding it on. He's putting pressure on Laguta here. We've got a good race on our hands. Here comes Bartosz Smarsnik! That's why he went for gate four. Well, that's just fantastic, isn't he? He turns his night around. Laguta's firing back at him. But Bartosz Smarslik, when it really matters, he's turning on the style, down the back straight, hanging off the back of the bike, looking a million dollars out in front now, Nigel, just about crept through on eight points, bars himself to the front, looking for his third world championship. After four heats, Smarslik was under pressure with only five points to his name. Now he's beaten Artem Laguta and he is in the final, but so is Artem Laguta. That result means the top two in the World Championship standings will go head-to-head -head again in the grand final wow. in Manila. What a race that was. Artem Laguta turning on the style. Absolutely confident in taking gate number four. Ripped around the outside. And the fastest man on show so far this evening is beaten. Artem Laguta is uh, beaten by Bartosz Smarslik. What a ride. Smarslik, Laguta, Saifudinov and Kubera. That's your lineup, that's your results, and what a ride from Smarsnik. I made the point, didn't I? Five points from four rides, and yet he could still score 20 tonight. Yep, absolutely right, and we'll see this again. And this is down to mental strength, you know. Complete belief in your ability. Has a bit of good fortune with the riders on the inside of him, bunching up on the inside, but you've still got to trust yourself. And look at this, he's looking around, he's got all the time in the world. He's going a million mile an hour, by the way. And he comes charging around the outside of Artem Laguta. And it is a spectacular ride, and it's a ride just at the right time. His last two rides have been terrific, and you wouldn't put it past him going on to win the night. Can't wait for the final, because you just sense that these two are going to be going at it again, Nights. They really are lighting up the Grand Prix season, aren't they? I'll tell you what, the late, great Simon Wig would have loved his style down the back straight. Long tracking, yeah. looking like Gerd Riss or yourself. Yeah, I Remarkable. agree with that. He, he is a wonderful rider. He has that ability to stretch his arms out and push his backside right over the back mudguard to 